Hello, my name is Nicolette Vig and I specialize in advanced skincare and well-being. Today I am here to answer you the question of how often should you have a professional treatment? Well, it really depends on you. It really, really depends on how old you are, your medical background, what is the concern we're trying to treat. So it really is uniquely tailored to you. A regular facial, a maintenance facial, we recommend it sort of every four to six weeks. This is a standard when you have just a maintenance level with your skincare. But when we are trying to treat a concern, we need to figure out what is it we're treating first. If it's complex, say for example, acne, we might want to treat the redness, the sensitization first before we treat the breakouts. If it's for example, pigmentation, we are going to do it much slower with over a longer period of time because pigmentation has to be treated cautiously. Now, this is where a, a professional consultation will come in handy. That You go to see your skin specialist, you sit down together and you work out a treatment plan tailored to you and for your skin's needs. So we need to understand as well the age because the skin cell renewal process, which is a natural process, slows down with aging. So say if you're in your 40s, it would take up to 40 days for one skin cell to be born, come to the surface and shed off. Now, we can obviously speed this process up with our professional treatments, but we cannot make your skin cells come to the surface much quicker. So if you're having professional chemical pills, for example, too often, that can actually backfire in terms of your skin will have like a flare up, a reaction, frosting, shedding. So it's really important that we understand your age, your concern, your medical background, and most importantly, what is it that your skin is trying to tell? What is that your skin is needing? So go to see your specialist, your skin specialist, sit down for a professional consultation and work out a treatment plan tailored to you. I really hope this helps you understand a little bit more about how often should you have a facial. Take care and I'll see you in the next video.